Okay, guys, so, um, today I decided to do a video on Plant Soup instead of Hang on, give me a second. Okay, there we go. So, uh, I just bought some new crocodiles, and, um, we'll see what happens this time. Okay, I'm trying to make sure that this goes super fast. Wait a tick. I was sure I did not add stuff. Hang on. I thought I already add stuff. Hang on. I still need to go to terrain. Oh wait, that's the stamp tool. Short grass. Yeah, I mean like now that looks better. Okay. I was, but I was pretty sure last time I did hire some staff. You know, whatever. Okay, one here. This is the. These are the caretakers. These. This is a keeper. Normally, I'd rather take three of everything, but I mean, like, if you do your first enclosure and all the animals eat the same thing, then you'd rather only have one keeper. I mean, like, really. Or else. Uh, I don't know. Also, in sandbox, you have sandbox settings. You can set anything you ever want. Uh, vendors, at least three, I think, for current. Okay, a uh, vet, and another vet, and three vets. Okay, and, uh, we don't really need an educator right now. And, okay, now they're gonna get the animals in the, uh, habitat as fast as they can. Oh, and that is a huge Torosaurus. That's, okay, why is that Nalu? Which, is, is the male still bigger? Jackson. Okay. How about, these are the saltwater crocs, they're already in. You gotta take, you have to take care of them, like with hard shelter and everything. Okay, done. And how about the Polosaurus? Good. Why does the Gariel need a uh, Simba the African Dwarf? I think that's a dwarf. Okay, now that is the male Purosaurus. Actually, the Purosaurus doesn't come with a name, because these guys are mods. Sometimes creatures don't even come with a name, but this time I have to name the Purosaurus Chomper, and also I have to name the other one Nalu, for some weird reason. That's the Morlet's Crocodile. Logan. Van Dweev. What do you mean tickets are underpriced? I set them too low because, uh, oh, uh, hang on, give me a sec. Okay, it, it is a problem. So, uh... Pretty much, I mean, like, this is the lowest that they can do. Okay, now pretty much everything that was swimming has teleported back. Okay, now is it glitching? Also, like, you can have, like, VIP guests come visit the zoo. Everny, Mira. Oh, gee, there's so many, there's so many crocodiles in here. Uh, okay, how can I rename you to... Why not call it Tiny? 
I mean, do any of you guys think it's a girl's name? Hang on. I think I forgot something that would really work. Uh, food enrichment. No, wait, now it's easier to buy. Because now it's added in food. That's an underwater box. Plant feeder as well. I don't know what that means. Okay, pretty much, uh, okay. Is this even deep enough? Feeder ready. Okay, this is deep enough. The water is deep enough. And now I'm just gonna set them a bit far away from each other. Wait, what is this? What is this? Where is- oh. Oh, shoot. They can escape. If I just swimming. Okay, I have to pause the game again. I what? I did not forget to put everything on. Okay, there we go. Uh, does it work this time? Uh, okay, now we'll put the water back in. Yeah, that's all I can do. And everything teleports back to the door again. Almost everything. This is actually kind of the problem when you have mods. Game goes laggy. I have a uh, small African exhibit. Hang on, are there any other small animal exhibits? Okay, so now what do we have? Classic? Wait, what? Okay, now it's working. What can we have in here? Mm, an exhibit animal market. So obviously this thing is like broken into two different things. I'm just gonna get const boa constrictors. Boas, anyways. Okay. Now I can get an alpha now. Okay, there we go. Now we have an alpha. Oh, like, not exactly an alpha? Okay. Best thing to do is just, like, turn on everything in here. Minus if you, if you kind of want to see other things. Uh, okay, so this is what I usually like to do. I, mean, I usually like to close all windows. Okay, so there's one, like, right here. Um... This is an educational board. Bow constrictor. There we go. My question is, can these guys even get out of the water? Oh, okay, they can. I, they can. I was getting a little bit worried about the Porosaurus. Especially since large creatures are, it isn't that easy for large creatures to get out of the water. Then, actually, we can help them all the time. But, okay. Um, no, not environment. The terrain's okay for the 
fresh water croc. I think all of these crocs are okay now. Okay, you might be thinking that maybe only the, uh, the, the smaller creatures can work. But no, you can do this. Okay, so this is usually what happens with mods. They don't exactly show up. Uh, have one right here. We'll have a Purasaurus on this one. Uh, African Dwarf Croc. Um, okay, poor sword, I think we'll have a crocodile. Central American, Central African, Slender's not a crocodile. Also, I'm pretty sure there was also an American alligator mod, but I'm pretty sure I forgot it that one. So maybe we can put some more creatures in here the next episode. Um, crocodile. Fresh one. So, freshwater crocodile, there's only Gallium and saltwater croc, which the saltwater croc can go right here, okay down to the bottom, saltwater crocodile and done. Black and white rough steamer. Central American Flinders is not rough. Oh, critical and endangered. Dinosuchus extinct in the wild. That reminds me, I don't even have a Dinosuchus. Okay, gotta go get a Dinosuchus. Please tell me that there are some good ones on stock. See, that's the problem about having a Dinosuchus. I can't. The game somehow just keeps glitching, and then they can't come in. So, the next talk is this one. Oh, this guy's still there. Animals unable to move. See, like that's the problem. Somehow I can't get a Dinosuchus, which is a bit annoying. Though I can't get the Nile Crocodile either, and there's already a mod on that. I'm pretty sure, yep, that is a Okay, that's the male. Crocs in this game are huge. Okay, now I'm thinking of what should I have next. Also guys, if you if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and, and um, turn on notifications. And also comment what animal do you want for the next episode. But maybe for me to go bears, hippos. I don't know if hippos can really do it. Now I'll then peacocks. Also if you guys don't know, peacocks actually get sick really easily. 
L-O-N. Don't try to find the jack in the monkey skull. It's not a monkey. It's an expansion pack. Uh, more with crocodiles. Copies. Pure Florence. Giraffe. Wait, hang on, weren't they usually... Aha, found the gorilla. Maybe she just have like an African monkey tribe. A huge tribe. And like, mostly it's pretty much called a tribe or something, whatever. I have no idea what to get this time. I'm like, African bush elephants. Wait, oh wait, look, actually we need to African savanna elephants, oh that's nice. Usually we just call elephants, like African elephants. Not exactly just elephants, but... Hang on, hang on. Hang on. So my idea right now is like not to obviously put in dinosaurs in this part because there are a lot of mods on dinosaurs. My idea is like to put as many modded creatures and normal creatures as I can. I was also planning on getting the mammoth, but some for reason it could be worked. Uh y'all want conda and all. Wait, Timberwolf. Ooh. I think I changed my mind. Maybe I want a wolf. I should totally get a wolf. I haven't got any in such a long time, and they're cute. Oh wait, also, um, this is... Usually I did this, um, no, not staff so geez. Yes, facility. Uh, so, I forgot to put on ATMs. Right next to those, um... Also, donation boxes. I mean, like, donation boxes are not very useful in if you're in like sandbox but usually if you play the game too long and then there isn't like any donation boxes or a or atm it's gonna force you to put one in not exactly forced it's just gonna tell you like you should really put that in oh yeah that's right the game has updated with like new zoo and stuff uh, finance, no, no. Uh, Planet Zoo Information Center. Nah, not really good, yeah. Bernie's Bakes Food Shop. Oh yeah, this is like an anniversary one. I think it only sells, uh, yeah, it's only a food stall. Uh, I'm just gonna have vending machine. And this is also very important when never you do this. Also, I forgot to put it down. Uh, large toilet. Obviously, like a creation I actually saw in like the CD workshop. It's like 
a creation of the official trailer. And these are some custom that I've made, but actually it's made of bamboo, so obviously, uh, Also, once I had like this as like a little house for art barks. Okay, is it really good to put like an a, a whole African village in here? Doesn't seem like it's big enough for like other animals to get in. Mostly, pretty much. Okay, anyways. <laughs> I think I'm wasting too much time. I should definitely start on the wolf enclosure. Okay, what look what 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 brings you the wolf like? Grade two. At, okay, at least grade two. There's no way there. Also, you might know that some animals are stressed, but no, I actually turned on sandbox settings. That doesn't actually make them stressed. You know, maybe I'd rather make it out of concrete, of uh, concrete wall. So you can increase the length here and uh let's go okay them down and also make the animals hungry, which is not good. Okay, so the hut is finished. Also, we only have one keeper, so there we go. Okay, there we go. What's he doing? Inspecting the crocs. What is the end called again? Ah, timber wolf. I'll just call them wolves. Cause maybe I'd probably download them. Also I have to edit the barrier. Okay, this way, this way. Oh yeah, also, you can pretty much uh, put trees. So 
just a way that you can put on like lilies. Grass, even though, hang on. No, it's only blowing up bubbles. Uh, apple trees. What's a fever? Uh, So mostly all the animal welfare is great. Okay, so... Uh, species, uh... Let's see... Timber, 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 Okay. Rotation line here. And the free set is back. Gift box management, cardboard box, chew toy, block of ice, and a bamboo feeder for some weird reason. This is like a panda park shop. So I, I obviously copied the whole season from the panda park campaign. And like the scenario. But it's like a Chinese theme, so not exactly the best. So, let's check. Coolers are very important. Because the wolves like cold temperatures. I, I'm not going to put every single type of wolf here. Minus like. It says that it was still easy. Australian DLC. Okay. There. I guess that can work. Okay, so this is actually a uh, blueprint, but I'm not gonna use it. Okay, why, I'm pretty sh why did I not use this for like the crocs? Oh yeah, that's right, because sometimes it glitches and you can't actually place it. Uh, New World Shelter, right here.
now I need to put down as much short grass as I can. 